Hey guys, so today I wanted to do a quick haul for you guys. It's not too much, it's just a um, little things I've been picking up here and there. Um, so, sorry I've been MIA for a while. Um, I've moved over 600 miles to a new city. Um, I love it so far. It's really hot, but other than that, you know, it's all good. My family's back together. So uh, I moved with my husband. So it's me, my husband, and my daughter now. So I do miss my mom a lot. But other than that, it's great here. I have been doing some shopping. I've been getting organized. I have a huge house and I'm trying to get everything situated. So that is why I've been missing in action. My actual computer that I usually film on isn't even set up yet. Uh, so I'm using my husband's laptop right now which I think I'm going to steal. But anyway, <laughs> um, so let's just get started. We can first start off with these little nail polishes. Aren't they so cute? They're from the Hong Kong collection by OPI. And they're in a little takeout box. Well, that's what this is supposed to be. Yeah. It's called Tiny Takeouts. <laughs> um, I really wanted to try this one color, and I was going to buy the full-size bottle. But I was like, you know what? I never go through a whole nail polish anyway, so I might as well get a few of them. Um, and this is Red My Fortune Cookie. It's like a pretty red. Um, and then this one is called Dim Sum Plum. Nice purplish fuchsia color. Uh, sushi says Feng Shu. <laughs> what? <laughs> Which is this blue color. And then just a rapid dry top coat color. I already have a top coat. Um, I actually used the Revlon, the two-in-one color. It's like um, a base coat and a top coat. So I use that one usually, but that one came with this. So those are my little takeouts. Um, another nail polish I got was by Revlon, and it is Make Mine Mango. I know my nails look horrible. I'm going to paint them today. Probably should have painted them before I did the video, but my monster is asleep, so I thought it would be perfect timing to do a video. So this is not my favorite color. Um, it's a little too orange for my liking. I am kind of pale, so this is just too bright. I do have it on my nails right now that looks horrible, but, um, so it's okay. But for coral, I really like Melon of Troy a whole lot better. So, it has more pink to it. It's like orange and pink. So I like that. Um, the next thing I have is this Aqua CoverGirl Smoothers Tinted Moisturizer. Um, it has SPF 15 in it and I picked the color Fair to Light. Now this is a product that I probably will not purchase again. Um, it's not horrible but it doesn't give me coverage at all. Like, I mean, I like how it fills on my skin and everything, but I don't know if I just got a color that's too light or what. I mean, I'm in C25 on the Studio Fix foundation so for MAC, so I'm pretty f light, you know, considering the lightest color they have is in C20 and it goes by fives, so I'm the next shade up. But um, anyway, so mm, it's okay. I'll probably use it just to use it up. Let me see if I can swatch it for you. So it's right there. And I rub it in. I mean, it's... I don't know. It doesn't really give me coverage like I would like it to. Of course, not like a foundation. I wasn't expecting it to be like a foundation, but I was expecting it to be a little bit more. What I got was this Tresemme Heat Tamer Spray. I'm sure everyone knows what this is. It's by Tresemme. Um, I was using the Iron Guard, but I love this stuff. It smells so good. And it doesn't have alcohol in it like in one of my past videos. If you want to watch, um, I said I didn't like products that had alcohol in it because it damages your hair more. So I got this 
awesome. It was only like three or four dollars, and it's a huge bottle. It's eight fluid ounces. So I got that. The next thing I got were these jumbo pencils by NYX. Um, the first one I got was is ice mocha, and the second one is yogurt. The ice mocha is kind of a brown color, and the yogurt is more like a pink color. Top one is iced mocha, and then this one is yogurt, if you can see it. So, um, they are really, I've never tried them before, but they're really, um, they're awesome. They're very easy and convenient. Just throw them on your eyes. Very glad I bought those. Um, the next thing I got was this Ulta Super Shine Lip Gloss. The reason why I got it, because it was like $2, I think, and it's pink. <laughs> and I was like, oh, I'll try it. And, you know, it's, for $2, it's good with me. And I doubt you're going to be able to see it, but, oh, I don't even know. Okay, right there. Okay. Um. <laughs> So yeah, it's just a shiny lip gloss, and it's pink. Um, it was really cheap, so I just bought it. Next thing I'm in love with now is this Hip Jelly Balm by L'Oreal. It's, it's in a little glass container, like the Paint Pots from MAC. It's this color. I got Succulent is the color I got. But I'm wearing it on my lips right now. Um, what HIP stands for is High Intensity Pigments. And this color is so pigmented. I could swatch it for you and you'll be like, what? You see that color right there? And it is, I love this stuff. It's my new favorite. The only thing I'm not too crazy about is you have to use your finger with it. But other than that, no biggie. Next thing I got... What is this uh, New York color cream stick? It's by um, NYC. I thought this color was going to be a little bit more curly. It's Plaza Pink is the name of it, but it's not. <laughs> I mean, it's really pigmented, but it's not my favorite. So that's that, but um, it seems like it's going to last forever, and it was very cheap. So if any of y'all know where to get NYX blushes, my Ulta doesn't sell them, so and I really wanted a cream blush, and I wanted this NYX one that I saw online. So if any of y'all know, let me know. Next thing I got really quickly is um, two matte cream blushes that I'm completely in love with. This one right here is Posse, I think, P-O-S-E-Y. And, oh, I love the color. That one. And then I got this one also, which is Lilicent, I think, L-I-L-I-C-E-N-T. And it's, well, you really can't see this color, but. But I love them. They look so good. The girl tried them both on me and I fell in love with both of them. So I was like, oh, I'll just take both of them. Why not? <laughs> the next thing I got are two things from the new collection in the groove, I believe. First thing is this lip gloss, which is pretty true to color. It's a very pink lip gloss. It is called right image and it's a cream sheen and I love the cream sheens I really do love that the next thing I got is a mineralized skin finish and the one I got is uh by candlelight yeah by candlelight oh and it is so pretty look how pretty it is let's see if I can it's just like um a, a highlight I cannot wait to use this product I don't know. You're probably not going to be able to see it, so I might as well not even try, but... <laughs> oh, it is so gorgeous. I'm so glad I got it. Um, I think that is it, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed. Um, if you have any questions, if y'all want to see me use any of these products or review any of them, just let me know, and I'll be more than happy to. Um, if you also have any suggestions on any videos, anything else... 
um, just go ahead, leave me, send me a message, leave me a comment, and I'll get back to y'all as soon as I can. Talk to y'all later. Bye.